Aloha! Hi everyone! In this video I will continue with the ghost mode. Uh, but first uh, let me change um, setting because see what settings. Because in the previous one my NVIDIA video card has a problem and just shut down and then reset but the obvious uh, setting was you know was messed up and that's why I have to um, to stop the video so water grass texture texture of foliage detail level hmm. all right let's make it a high and see if everything will be fine detail texture grass actually I may leave it this but yeah we don't need that much grass and yeah let's see if I don't have any more problems continue the hair works all right a little bit for now all right here we are this bard's tale begins near white orchard with my dear friend Geralt of Rivia seeking his lover of yore, the sorceress Yennefer. She'd eluded him for years, but now seemed just a few steps ahead. Now, in the previous video, uh, there was the fight against four drowners that kills us, that kill us uh, a lot of times. Now. Uh, Oh, that was not very smart. Ooh. Oh, my goodness. So we have to be very careful. Oh, a little tricky. Oh, my goodness. Oh, we almost died. This is ridiculous. What did you do by Tarzan? Both of these archers. Time to end this. Oh, come on, man.
Oh, he doesn't have a stamina. Oh, that was quite a brutal fight. Ah, oh, man. That coffee. Fork. Uh, we lost two potions and we don't have another uh, another tricky one. <coughs> we don't have another alcohol. Wyvern decoction. Uh, let's see the Wyvern here. Or the Wyvern. Casting a sun increases your melee attack power by 70%, up to 50. Resets after dealing melee damage and at the end of the combat. Not bad. This was a rather tricky one. Let's try this bandit camp, although it would be tricky. Still level 1. Oh, 88 out of 2, out of 100. Hmm. Most probably. We'll go first and raid them. That's it, Roach. Song. So early on, it's quite tough usually in the game, even in the previous one. Even in the vanilla, the first 10 levels, uh, toughest. It's Durban now. D E R V A N, not Boydemar. What do you mean? I know what they named you at your cutting. What kind of name is that anyway? Durban. Nilfgaardian. My gran was from Nazaire. Oh, so that's how it is. Then by my leave, Master Durban, may the gold sun guide you far away from my land. Usually these guys are over here. Customer, welcome. What can I do for you this time? Show me what you got. Hmm. Let's see the dismantling. This is a nice one. Ah, monster brain. We're gonna need this. Not enough coin, of course. Ah. Oh, it's quite heavy. Hmm. 
Well, I've been Witcher's two sword. Might cost you monster blood. Ah, uh, we need this one. One more. Gonna trade the others. Good. So long. Greetings. Let me have a look at I think this homemade pepper vodka could be used as an alcohol. It's logical. Take care. Right. Hey. Excuse me, kiddo. Oh, let's come here. Oh, right, there was now to save. Let's go.
No yes, counter attack. Well, that was a good fight. Although, again, it was a kind of a tricky game because on, the, on the one time we got out of stamina, so the Tony O was a good decision. Interrogation report uh, that Witcher Kogrim Serpentine Steel Sword. And we have the Viper School gear. Yeah, these bandits, for what they're gonna die for. For Timeria? No. With Pitchy Camp, God is a great spot, middle of the loots, near that old mill. Now we're all set to go out on our first raid. Yeah. Alright. Let me just uh, get all of those herbs. Usually they are very rare, especially that Bray Onion. Bray Onion. They are always near the walls. Next place. Poor people. They were ambushed by the bandits. Oh, beware! Bandits calling themselves the Maria Soldier are hiding in the nearby woods. They have been declared outlaws and a threat to the Emperor's subjects. Assisting or shattering them in any way will be summarily punished to the fullest extent permitted by Imperial law. On behalf of the Emperor of Nilfgaard, Captain Peter. Windy. Yep, we deal with them. Right, Roji? Alright, Roji, stay here. It's the enemy. It's nearby. So, again, look at this 62. Man. 888, 886, 22. Weapon. Oops. Oh, so it seems that when I repair it, it got back its enhancement. Or maybe when I don't know. Or maybe when it is enhanced by those oh, enhanced weapons. Oh, now I get it. So when we get this enhancement, let me just see it. One. Four, three, four. Yeah, based on this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whether they are enhanced. Wow, that's a cool. So these bonuses will apply only when we go to the grindstone.
That was greedy. Our first finisher. Ooh. Oh, I'm starting to get used to these bandits with the two handed weapons. They have two attacks, so we have to be very careful once we. Oh, back potato. That's good. Now let's save. After all, uh, every battle. We shall do this. Um, where is the mill? Uh, I think the mill was here. Yeah, the mill was here, and here was a, mm -hmm, a tricky part. All right, so I'm gonna go to the crossroads, then come here to here to open the door. But oh, oh actually, first I will go to the mill section. Here is the frying pan. Very very nice and easy quest early on that gives you um, that gives you a lot of food early on, which is important. I'm just collecting herbs and at the same time I'm regenerating my health out of combat. That's nice how uh, the developer of the mode decided that during your battles you see that the food doesn't actually give you uh, almost uh, doesn't give you anything so Rochi you're again almost full Yeah, with that well. I'm just preparing myself for that boss fight against the witch. Yeah, nice ducks. Not so fast, Roach. Now if I enchant them, it shall be 1000, yeah, this is it ladies and gentlemen, I finally get this one. Alright. A so. return customer. Like it a forge. Yeah, he can forge. Crabs. Oh, nice one. We have this lesser Murana runestone changed to poison. That can help us early on with that money. And I'll really trade it by the way. That's wonderful. Alright. 
right. So long. Uh, yeah, we can make that oil because I found the monster brain. Uh huh. Well, finally, necrophage oil. Rochi, where are you going, man? I mean, horsey, not man, but horsey. Um, let's make the frying pan. And come through here, that's nice. with the people now in theory you can be attacked here by wolves and you can use the galleons to protect you This hurt, that is, till the night afore the battle, a man arrived, walked right in like to his own, standing around him, peering at the goings on, most of all, cause next I knew, there he was, coming my way. So, I grabbed me pan, for protection, see, but he just asks all polite, Gran? Got any birch bark by chance? Lilac berries or even a few coals? Nay, says I. And you must be right daft to pester folk at night with such foolery. I see he's been listening. Just staring at me pan like a magpie at a copper. Lend it to me, Gran. I'll give it back come morn. He's right baffled for what's he doing, frying in the dark. But I've got a soft heart, so I gave it to him. Interesting. What happened then? Before dawn, another rode up to the hut. But come on, only the first fella left. Locked the door, hopped on his horse, and that were all I saw of him. And me pan. Twere old, black with soot, not worth much, I suppose. But I've no other. Will you help me, dearie? Bring an old widow or a pan. <laughs> I could never break down that door myself. And in truth, I'm a fear to go in any road. Such a stench wafting out. Methinks the other fellow. Well, that he's lying there. Never taken on a pan contract. Fine, I'll go in, look around. You should wait here, just in case. Nice. Mm. A corpse explains the stench. Cracked monocle. Interesting. What's that, dearie? Nothing, nothing. His throat. He was garroted. And some old scars. Kind of soldier might have. But when I gab to myself, they say I'm going barmy. Oh, nice. Although again, uh, you know, not that much useful formulas for us, such as potions or decoctions, but it's fine. 
Documents, almost entirely burnt. A few pieces still legible. And when you arrange to meet, you show up. I did risking my life and the entire blasted operation, and ended up standing there with my plowing cock in my hands, waiting for nothing. I told the New Guardian army was better organized than that, but you, illegible, tell that blessed war general of yours that me and my companions don't hold grudges, so we won't back off negotiations. But since our old plan's gone, it's up. This time we will choose the time and place for the next meeting. Yeah, nice one. The pan, have you? Ah, the priceless frying pan. Huh, scrubbed clean. Looks like the mystery man didn't need the pan so much as the soot off it to make ink write letters. Yeah. Here, your frying pan. Mine? But mine were black with soot. And I could see myself in this sun if I wanted. But them years are past. It was the soot the man needed. He scraped it off to make ink. Must have had an urgent letter to write. Urgently burned some other documents too. And... and the other fellow? Dead. Round up a few boys and bury him outside the village. Deep, so the necrophages don't dig him up. And take my advice. Don't mention this to the North Guardians. Hang about! You've earned a token of thanks. Here's for the road. Thank you, Granny. Let's see. What we got? Experience points 10. Baked apple. Bright. Apple juice. Alright, it's good, it's good. Now, ladies and gentlemen. Continue our journey. Oh, nothing here. Ah, here it is. Yeah, so I remember correctly. Here I think it was in place of power. A lot of wolves. Be careful. These raids 
Uh, tricky one. You see that they shouldn't attack us otherwise. Ugh. Stamina regeneration. doing by the way quite a lot of critical hits when they were inside well, inside the Irden which is strange by the way oh, wow very strange Andranos were here we have leveled up now, my idea is that since uh, we will do a lot of counter attacks or even partial parties or counters, now we have to reduce this because look at this. I mean, uh, when we are left without mana, we can do partial parties and partial counters when they are doing the heavy attacks. So, definitely, this skill is now becoming very, very important early on. And if you think about it, I shall not go for Frenzy early on, because... Mm, uh, because... Uh, we don't have uh, toxicity above zero, so we still don't have a useful decoction, so... These skills will wait, although here, yeah, this one is very cool as well, you know, my favorite here. Um, so for now, we're gonna focus on the deflection. And eventually resolve, but that will be after our alchemy. So, uh, let's see here. Partial party reduces damage taken by 50% and prevents bleeding. Right, so here we have damage taken for partial parties is reduced by additional 10% to 40% total. So, you can see here there were 15, now it will be. So, then we will be uh, down to the 30. Perfectly timed parries reflect arrows back at the attacker. Alright, now we need just that second level. Wait to restore my health. Yeah. Yeah, we can't still use this aura. Right. So that oil, well, twenty five percent attack. Power versus Necrophages. This attack effectiveness against Necrophages effectiveness decreases with all rubbing of the blade. 
Show me what you got. They're kind of a bugged here, these two. Bugged horn. Yeah, I remember it. We gonna need five, I think, worth for the cure well. Let's collect that bugged horn. There's a body here. Let's restore our health. Valuables, and they're right at the mill as well. Yeah, next to the. Here we go. Okay. Head. Nice one. Potion. Oh, we got overweight. Now we can't run. Ah. 
Now the interesting part is that uh, the developer of the mode made it so you can't of course run while you are uh, overweight and uh, you can't use a fast uh, teleports as well, your roach cannot run, you get a penalty when you fight, so you better not fight. Yeah, you can see how now we cannot run. So let's go let's go back and now we can drop a thing here and that would be wiser and then just you know make that pass teleport. This is the wisest thing. Well lumberjack. I don't know how um long the items are Look at that axe. Now, what do we have to... Hmm. We sort the items by weight. <laughs> so maybe that's how people are doing usually near the fast traveler, but I don't know how many, how long this item will remain. Goosey hmm. goosey. Customer. Show me what you got. Hmm, other monster tissue. Uh, I think I'm gonna use this. Oh, nice, but uh, we better. So, eighty six. Oh, we may need that. Silver ingot. So 86 and now we traded to 19. We have a steel ingot, we don't have an iron ingot. Mm, that's quite costly for the silver ingot, but... Alright. And... Mm, we're gonna trade this chance to stun. That necklace, wonderful.
So long. Fifty two. Uh, most power. No, these these are actually mm, not that much. So we got four, six, six, fourteen, sixteen, eighty, twenty one, twenty two. 27 is only from ourselves. All the rest are from here. All right. We have that stash. Yeah. Just here that stash. the bombs because I really would like to make bombs lots of bombs quicksilver solution and a monster bomb quicksilver mm, we're gonna need this a calcium echo quicksilver solution It's best to actually first yeah try to make that quest or the the spectre quest because this area here has a lot of resources. But first, hmm, let's finish this one. Uh, this will be quite tricky. Um, but all the others are uh, you know monster nests. We shall come here. All right, we're gonna try that. Raids, although it's tricky, but very, very tricky. Fight. Let me have a cup of water. Wish me success, buddy. The rate went back down. The 
Good. Ah, not great. Why it's sticking, by the way? Fights with raids. Ha! Which are this favorite? Oh, you shall use the time where uh, the raid is spawning. Usually, when it is one raid, you don't have problems. But when there are a lot of raids, well, then there is a problem. Mm -hmm. Letter from Witcher Cogrim, the Viper School. The poor Witcher caught him. It's very bad that he died. Expect this uh, will prove a bit of trouble. Perhaps I already have returned our key by the time you receive this letter. Yeah, Cogrim, Cogrim. Such a sad story. You can uh, see my first walkthrough. The place of power. Gained one ability. All right, Roji, we're returning. Distance to bleeding. That's very good, especially yeah, against you know that Griffin. Yeah, our toxicity decay rate is very good, thanks to that uh, generic bonus. Vitality drain. Damage taken from partial parties huh, will be, you know, reduced by an additional 30% on the final deflection level. And when multiple enemies are around, party cost is decreased by 50%. Oh yeah, that's very nice, by the way, because for now the party is costing you much five, which is a lot. Then the party will be 2.5, which is very good because our stamina regeneration will be 15, so that's good. We'll be able to... Uh, to survive with the passiveness. Goosey goosey. Look at how beautiful a witcher is. That game is awesome. A return customer. A return customer. Show me what you got. Let's see the dismantling process. Steel, iron, steel. Better scraps and wire. Yeah, but this price is much more because this is, you know, a master level, uh, master item. This is a poor item, a common one. We're gonna trade the other things. This will be quite costly. For a burning, no, thank you. We're gonna just trade this 23 gold or crowns.
Hmm. We're gonna go with our uh, for now our Kermorin set to a nine. So long. Sleep, child. Sleep. Sleep will lend you strength. Greetings, good man. Having trouble with your well? That's what I read. Aye. Tis haunted. Has been for a good twenty years. Twenty? So why do you put out a notice just now? Because earlier on we drew our water from the river. But so many corpses floating in it after the battle, it's turned noxious. My daughter Mandy drank half a pitcher. Felt dreadful ill, can't keep nothing down. She grows worse by the day. Herbalist claims you fight a fever with drink. And not beer nor cider, but water. Clear, pure water. And where am I to get that if not from the well? But first, the ghost's got to be driven away. And it don't let any man near. This ghost. Describe it for me. Well, it's awful frightening. Awful. I meant what does it look like? It looks like a woman, but fresh from the grave. Wears a dirty dress, all rags, its skin flaking off its bones, and it howls like it's suffering. Some wraith, or maybe an alp. If you don't wallop it, master. If you don't take care of it, that is, it'll come kill me daughter. Fine, I'll help. Where's this well? In Havel. A settlement on the heights. It's abandoned now, no one ventures there on account of the ghost being about. Drive it off. Please. Right. We're gonna do this. We're a witcher after all. Orange and Florence. <coughs> oh, yeah, we have crowns. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Come on, Roche. Hey -ya. Now, I think we will level up if we do the Herbalist quest and we will lock access to the Herbalist. And when we are level 2, Freak. without party, it would be very good for us.
what I think the, 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 the Mirror's quest, yeah, it will, it will lock, it will unlock when we go to the main story. Which means that we shall. What do you want, Wanderer? Shall, by the way. Gonna scream for help. So beautiful. Jump on this quest. A waste of time. Drowners. So beautiful. Man, that's um it's really tough to see. It's so realistic. Military camp. No locals allowed without the express consent of the garrison commander. I look like a local to you. You look like trouble. Dead wrong. I make trouble go away. I'm a witcher. A witcher? Captain Peter Sugwin Levy is in the tower. Turn right, past the gate. Huh. You black ones aren't so scary after all. Can even be nice if you want to. Don't get accustomed, Nordling. To the tower. Go. Is it true? Northern women bathe but once every three moons? Yeah. I'm just enjoying the view. Oh, we can't for now get this chest. We must requisition the share of your harvest. Hi, your excellency. Uh, I know there is little left in your granaries. 
But soldiers are men too, and so they must eat, correct? I yes. How much grain will your village give? Whatever you say, Your Excellency. Look at my hands. Look. See the calluses? These are not the hands of an Excellency, but of a farmer. So we speak peasant to peasant. How much can you give? Forty bushels. There'd be more, sir, but our lads, the Temerians, that is, took from us earlier and... You will give thirty, and that will do. Let us settle on it, and I wish to see the transport soon. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you kindly. I summoned only the Elderman and the Smith, Willis. But it is said he is a dwarf. You are too tall to be him. Plan to requisition something from him, too? If it is necessary, yes, of course. We are at war, in case you have not noticed. Who are you? Speak! Geralt of Rivia. Witcher. Vatgarn. This explains why I did not hear your footsteps. What do you seek here? Yennefer of Vengerberg. Where was she headed? That is a military secret. Haven't thrown me out yet. Haven't called the guards. So go ahead. What's your price? There is a griffin in the area. Slay it. And then I shall see what I can do. Why do you care about this griffin? Because I care about people. The beast has killed ten already, including a few of my men. To hunt it, I would need to mobilize the entire garrison, comb the woods, organize a batu. Simply impossible. Too big a hassle? No. Too high a risk. I cannot disperse my forces. Temeria's army we have crushed, but its common folk remain. Ready to answer a call to arms. So, as to this griffin, I can sit on my hands or hire a professional. It's a deal. Some questions before I start. Know where the griffin has its lair? It kept to the Vulpine Woods at first. I sent a patrol there, five young men. A hunter found them two days on. They only recognized them because they wore our plate. Since then, the griffin has grown bold. Attacks in villages, fields, on the main road. Meaning it's abandoned its lair. Gonna have to set a trap. I judge from your tone this will not be easy. What do you require? I'll need bait. A specific herb. Buckthorn. Scent should lure the griffin from ten miles off. Buck... Buckthorn? I do not know this. But I am not yet fluent in the common tongue. Mm -hmm. Probably mastered the basics, though. Hands up. Kill them. No. First came idioms. Don't play with fire, for example. Go to Tomira, oh. an herbalist. She lives near the crossroads. She will aid you. Need more information about this griffin, its sex, why it's abandoned its lair. Shall I bring you witnesses? They won't say anything I don't already know. I need to go where your men died. Look around. What's the name of the hunter who found them? Mislov. He has a hut south of the village, very near the wood. Helpful fellow. A little strange, though. Tamira and Mislav. Thanks. Yeah, good luck. Ah, we found the book, the book home. Yeah, and that's why. But we'll go for the Tamira. Yeah. Uh, no, not here. We'll go here. Password. Don't know any. So, out for a little walk, eh? Counting the Emperor's swords to lull you to sleep? Well, in the army, we've a place for nosy rattlers. 
the scaffold. And thick skulled quartermasters, they got a place. <laughs> uh, you're clearly skilled at banter. And haggling? You got a knack for that as well. Morale holding up around here? You boys think you can win this thing? Ah, a spy after all. Or one to stir trouble. Neither. Just curious. Right. Well, tell anyone who cares we will win this war, because Radovid is mad. As everyone knows, and we've an extraordinarily well-drilled and well-supplied army. Incidentally, did you wish to buy something? <laughs> Show me where you're peddling. Have we found a game that covered the gauntlets? Ah. Offers optimal protection. Yeah, and that resistance to bleeding is good, but. Ah! Only 10% of item durability restored? Eh. Ah. That's a nice one. It will hit chance in slashing damage. Less rune stone, very important one. Other than points, so sapphire, monster brain, lesser rune stone. Wow, they changed yeah, the requirements for these crafting recipes. Usually they were uneasy, and they were the lesser one too, was worth two percent, not three. But here, look at this. We need the lesser one stone, the monster bone, the diamond dust. Now that makes sense for this dust, which usually was not used, by the way. Mm hmm. All right. We don't have anything to this month. So of course this one is very useful. This one. Scrap. What about the crafting? Uh, Viper Silver. Oh come on man, it was level 2. Now they made it level 3. We have that going well. Oh, that's beautiful. Look at this. Beautiful, but we need for nutri. Poison damage. <coughs> Check poison. <coughs> the Skellige longsword. <coughs> it was level 2. <coughs> Unfortunately. Now it is level 3. We see power bonus. Oh, it, they definitely nerfed this. It was 75. The Viper Steel Sword. That's nice. So this means that maybe we shall buy this recipe for. It's actually yeah, it's level level two, right? Are we gonna do this slashing damage and critical hit chance? We're gonna use this Steel Sword. Definitely. Yeah, the others are level 3. So... Here it is. We can do this. Why is this 6? Let's see. Actually, let's not get ahead of. Like it. 
not get ahead of ourselves. Because there may not be humans so at level 2 and we'll just go for the level 3. I think there was here an armory. Yeah. Now it's interesting what this will give us as a bonus. 33. Enhanced armor. Wow! A boost of 5% for all of the resistances? Nice one. Nice. So it does make sense to go for the enhanced armor. We're gonna go to the Herbalist, do the quest, come here to the abandoned site and we will level up, get our skill and then continue with uh, the raid, most probably. This is the mirror. Yes. Griffin do that to her. Delina. Yes. Attacked her at night. She was walking in the woods. At night? Through the woods? In wartime? Meeting a boy. The young, you know, do foolish things for love. Wounds are healing, but she will die. Blood's pooling in her skull. Nothing my bruise can do to help. Could try to help her with one of my potions. Swallow can heal internal hemorrhages. But? Witcher's potions aren't for humans. She'll die as it is. Yes. A peaceful death soothed by your concoctions. If I give her Swallow and something goes wrong, the whole village will hear her screams. I understand. Do as you will. Tell me something about yourself. What's your story? A sad one. Do you know the Temple of Melitale in Alanda? Do I know it? Can't remember how many times I've been there, how many times Mother Nenica stitched me up. We must have missed each other. I started to become a healer under Mother Nenica. Hmm. I was but 18 when they took me in. An age at which teachings interest one far less than love. There was a boy, Goslath. He'd bear his chest to work. The novices couldn't keep their eyes off him, tripped over their own feet, dropped things. I left the temple for him. We passed a lovely summer together, and then he left. <laughs> Neneke refused to take me back. My parents uttered not a word. Gave me a travel cloak and a small coin pouch. I struggled long to find a place where I'd feel safe, needed. Until I finally arrived here. End of story. Got any herbs you're willing to sell? I'm sure I can find something. White goo. Important one. Roll decoction. Gains plus 100 to non combat. Vitality regeneration. And plus. Wow, this roll decoction is finally worthy. And plus 20 to combat vitality regeneration. When your stamina is at 33% in duo, gain plus 80 to combat vitality regeneration. Wow! Nice! Nice one! Toxicity offset reserves an amount of your maximum. Yeah, we gotta get this one. So we need a Dwarven Spirit, a Troll Mit. Oh man, come on, man. Oh, we need a Troll Mitogen and a Honeysuckle. Noon rated decoction. When you kill a phone, 
gain plus one to combat stamina regeneration per a life enemy nearby. Max bonus cannot exceed plus 10. Resets at the end of the combat. Very useful, by the way. Plus one to combat stamina regeneration. That's nice, especially for a heavy build. And what we have here, my Atmum Spirit. Yep, we're gonna buy this as well. Right. Farewell. On oh, that's bad. Take the potion to the herbalist. We made a small potion. Yes. Got a potion for Lena. Swallow. First sign of spring. Symbol of rebirth. Fitting as names go. We'll see. Like I said, could harm her. Deeply. Works on me immediately. But I have a faster metabolism. Effects won't appear in her case for a few days. Why'd you choose this in the end? Decided it was better than doing nothing. I like you, Witcher. Here. A small gift for giving a damn. Thank you. Oh, usually the gift is very good in the vanilla version. Let's see what we got here. Experience points. It's understandable. Crowns, but come on, a recipe. Venom extract. Yay! Ah, a curse though. Well, could have been something better, but. Of sweat and blood. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Wedding wreaths, favorite toys. Yeah, this is definitely for the raid. Night raids. And the noon raids as well. Plague maidens. Bistari, our Q count. <laughs> is there how many times we died? There is no, no such a. All right. Humanoids, drowners, goose. You can see this. Twenty-one monsters. Raids. Bears. A near unmatched ability to kill. Yeah, we almost died by the way. Uh, hybrids, we have the griffin, the necrophages, specters, nitrates, ghosts, noon raids, plague maidens, and the reds themselves. Look at this. Eh. To hear their mournful holes, one can surmise this is not a fate to be in, but the envy. Hmm. Almost level up, so we're gonna do this to level up. The do we have an alcohol? Two on alcohols. And here in the alchemy, two and three. Homemade pepper vodka. All right. Good. 
Or distort. A cursed or Petris filter. Increase sign intensity. Very useful. That essence the Dwarven Spirit. Accumulation of adrenaline points. Very useful. Augu. Oh man, we need an Augu call. Necker's eye. Alk Hest. Owl Spirit. A Hackman Spirit and a White Girl. I think there were goose. Wait a second. Don't worry. level 1, usually they were level 5, which is quite ridiculous. Uh, these are Nickers, and Nickers are quite tough by the way. Very tough. one we'll have to use that swallow
They just spawn. Ah, clever ones. All right, so we eliminated a lot of makers here. So that's good, it wasn't that bad. Hmm, 94%. Hmm. We found a lot of uh, raw meat. It has toxicity, which is understandable, by the way. It's not dead or nuts. <coughs> Let us wait because there'll be a lot of goose. A beautiful witcher. It's nice that they made that Kermoran set, so you can upgrade it, you can look cool. How many seconds is that it in? Because it is so so little. Seven point five seconds. And the radius is low, but That was not very smart.
Ooh. Uh, good one. We managed to do it. Oh. We leveled up. Wonderful. Say what they will. Me, I'll never forget what you did for us. Mercy. God speed your work. Wouldn't mind a look at your stock. Oh, we can trade him this. We're gonna need this. Farewell. I guarantee. Not speed your work. Not speed your work. Oh, mate, pepper vodka. Was used to replenish our alchemy potions and decoctions. What potions we have now? We're leveling up, we leveled up, so we may finally bring here another skill point. It's a nice one. Damage taken for partial parties and counters is reduced. Nice. Now we can have a mutagen, but still we don't have anything here. Oh, we finished this one. The next question is for level 4, what shall we prepare, by the way? Hmm. I shall start with my alchemy. A quarter tolerance is a good one, yeah. A quarter tolerance, so we may gain more toxicity eventually. You know, is one refreshment, restoration, frenzy, maximum stamina. So that sword was level level two, but it was for humans. Uh, I think we don't have anything for level. Yeah. Ah, uh, no, no, no. Shall we continue on the hunter where he found the bodies? No, not this one actually, the Witcher contract. Hello, Song Bridge.
un petit temps. We're gonna wait two more percent. Go, go. More percentage. What happens to your mug? I think here was the hunter. Yeah, the hunter village. The infamous well. Strange. No sign of a ghost. Maybe it only shows at a certain time of day. Bodies dried to a crisp. Signs of burns. Grass around the well scorched. All signs point to a new wraith. New what? wraith won't stray too far from the well. I like this part. There's a lot of things here. They will buy the well. The residents of White Orchard had suffered more than their fair share of misfortunes. Passing armies had trampled their spring planting, a griffin had begun abducting their livestock, and the rotten icing on this painful cake. A noon raid haunted a nearby well. No wonder the locals called this final evil a devil. The Witcher could sense something bound her to this place, and that in order to send her off into the ethereal realms, he would first need to learn her secret. Once that was done, he would have to prepare for battle. An unknown rate is a demanding opponent. She can disorient her victim by blinding him and creating mirror images of herself. These copies slowly suck their victim's life energy, while their mistress remains untouchable. <coughs> Recover health, by the way. In order to defeat her, the Witcher could not rely on his silver sword alone. The Irden sign would also be needed to trap her and force her to take on material form. Yeah, no joke. We have that Ogrids, that Neckers. Here they should point an Irden. And now I really like the fact that this lore here is correct. A lone necker is harmless, 5 are dangerous, 10 can kill even a veteran monster slayer. Particularly troublesome are the larger, stronger individuals known as warriors, as well as the raid breed of neckers known as Fukas. Journal might be useful. Yeah, that lovely story. A sad one. I won't read it because of my voice, and uh, you know it. For my first walkthrough. So I already uh, read about the moon rates. Something's tied the Noon Wraith to this place. An object. Something she needs before she'll leave this world. That was a miskick. Potatoes, candy,
We earn vitality, but not that much, unfortunately. Usually, we get more, I think. Ugh, this is such a nerfing. Or maybe they did, it's not that much. If it is only 50, then 20 levels by 50 is 1000. Alright, alright, it makes sense. A man, stabbed with a knife, died on the spot. Animals fed on his body, picked his skeleton clean. More blood stains over there, but it's not his blood. Palm prints in blood. Small hands. A woman's. Someone dragged her out. She was wounded. Fought for her life. No body in sight, but might still find some tracks. Under the right conditions, bloodstains can remain visible for decades. Another print by the well. Bloodstains. Almost faded. But the line's taut. Something's not right. A corpse. Hanged by the bucket rope. Woman the journal belonged to. Must be. Wide pelvis, small jaw. A woman. Around 30, judging by the teeth. Left arms missing. Need to cremate the remains. Gotta find the object that binds her to this place before I do, though. Was she wearing the bracelet from her husband? Might be why her arm fell off. Gotta jump down there. Hope I don't break my legs. Yeah. Green mod. <laughs> Lucky not to come up empty handed. A bracelet with an inscription to Claire from Volker. Bracelet must have belonged to the woman in the well. Lovely craftsmanship, but I'll have to burn it with the body to get rid of the noon wraith for good. Better do it near the well. A Hackamon steel sword. Nice. Yeah, get out, but we don't have anything. 
I mean, crystal, yeah, but need this monster bone. Baked potato. Didn't found calcium. Alright, we're gonna go and trade stuff. Actually, here is the alchemist. I mean, not the alchemist, but the herbalist, not an alchemist. What? Got anything interesting? Blizzard. Hmm, gray pack. That's a nice one, by the way, right? About that Gwen. Is the Witcher's resistance to bleeding, burning? Poison effects as well as to fire and poison damage by 50%. Lovely. But we need an earth elemental mutagen. A good luck. And dealing melee damage to enemies increases your attack power by 10%. Yep. Water hack will be very, very useful. Now, let's create our salmon bomb and the grape shop because. Yeah, just need to craft that. Grape shops. Salmon as well. Good. Out here, the spectral. We kind of need this. Let's get two of them. Oh, Dog Tail! Oh, we can buy even Dog Tail. Spectral, alright. Who's Bane? We're gonna need this, by the way, so that's why I'm buying it. Huh. Cat. <laughs> Honeycomb. Oh! I should have attacked. Yeah. Bee. Bee's nest. So I need monster bone. Now we have a bombs, that's good. That's very very good. Let us first come here, dismantle things and see if we can make our spectral oil. That's it, Roach. And I'll stop the video. We'll continue later on.
Let's go. All right. See you in the next video.